That is a little harsh. I mean, it's too, too rough. Jackson Heights resident Marco Romero reacting to the news. The Trump administration plans to reject green card and visa applications for legal immigrants if they rely on public benefits. Romero's sister's boyfriend may drop SNAP benefits because of this. He's worried that because of the food stamps, he won't be able to be able to do the citizenship. While Romero says the family will help him with food, not everyone has this support system. We look at this as like a clear attack on immigrants from the Trump administration. Abby Susell of the New York Immigration Coalition says immigrants who receive SNAP benefits, housing assistance or Medicaid will have 60 days to decide if they want to keep it or drop it. The new regulation goes into effect in mid-October. Although the group of people that are directly affected might be small, the impact for New York immigrant communities is huge. So we've already seen that millions of people are dropping off of benefits. If people are not able to be self-sufficient, then, then this negative factor is going to bear very heavily against them um, in a decision about whether they'll be able to become a legal permanent resident. The acting director of U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services says this new regulation is intended to encourage people to be self-sufficient. It will also help promote immigrant success in the United States as they seek opportunity here. Mayor Bill de Blasio tweeted today, we won't stop fighting for our immigrant brothers and sisters. Real Donald Trump will see you in court. Various groups are already promising a legal challenge. Keep in mind, this does not affect every immigrant, but there is a hotline you can call to find out if you are affected by this new regulation. It is the New Americans Hotline, that number, 1-800-566-7636. All calls are confidential and anonymous.